There comes a time in a mechanic's life where the satisfaction of making something work just overcomes anything else. It's just the best thing. Uh, a while back I posted a video on this 1953 Nash. It's the Country Club hardtop. It's not my car, but I'm trying to get it to run. I've actually been trying to get it to run for about three weeks. Uh, this car has at least been sitting for 30 years. When I first started working on it, it had 30 pounds of compression in the cylinders and somebody had cut the um, core support, going to pull the engine out because I thought it was bad. And that might have been the best thing. So uh, after oiling the cylinders, getting the engine to actually turn over, it was completely stuck when I got it. Um, and then going from 40 pounds of compression to about 60, and I've oiled the cylinders, you know, a little more. An Optima battery, 12 volt charge on a six volt system, a new solenoid, a new starter. It runs, you can still see the smoke coming off of it. It's, uh, it's hard to start, but I wanna show you something else. There's a pool of transmission fluid that came out the exhaust pipe right there. One of the tricks that I learned, and it may not be the safest trick in the world, is on a car that's low of compression, you can take your shop vac, stick it into the exhaust pipe, and it pulls uh, air through, just like a vacuum would, and it effectively increases the compression of the engine. So like I said, it's not the safest thing in the world. You can actually blow yourself up, but it worked in this case, and I wanna thank one of the fellows in the DKW club for alerting me to that. Otherwise, this car would have never have started. And I'm pretty excited that it's now running. 1953 Nash, hardtop. It's gonna join the world soon.